guys, are here. Today I'm doing the Eureka Math Grade 4 Module 1 Lesson 1 Homework, and this is the first lesson of Grade 4. So let's get started. Number 1. Label the place value charts. Fill in the blanks to make the following equations true. Draw disks, disks in the place value chart to show how you got your answer using arrows to show any regrouping. Alright, so let's take a look at what we have here. So again, like I always say, one of the most important things when doing a math problem is understanding the problem itself. So let's see, this is our place value chart. So it says start by filling in the blanks. So here we have ones, and then here we have tens. And after tens, we have hundreds. And then we have thousand all right so here the problem is 10 times four ones well 10 times four is 40 which means 10 times four ones is 40 ones and 40 ones is the same as 40. but how we can show this on a place slide chart to show how we got this so 40 ones we have one Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and again. And last row, close. So yeah, here we have forty ones, and now that we can regroup, so we circled to a group of ten. So a group of 10 will lead to the next place value. So we have 10 ones, and that would go and make 110. And then we have another group of 10 ones here that would make another 10. And now we have a third group here that would make another 10. And now this one, our fourth group of 10, we can make another 10 with that. So here we made four tens, and we know four tens is 40, so that can show how we got our answer. And let's see, B, we have 10 times two tens. So 10 times two tens, 10 times two is 20, so then that would give us 20 tens. So let's see, let's first label our place value chart again. Ones, tens, hundreds, and over here would be thousands. So I have 20 tens. So here's a 10. So let's draw 20 tens. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So here we have 20 tens. So if we take a group of 20 tens, I mean a group of 10 tens, and 10 tens equals 100, which means that this group, we can create it and make it together to form 100. But then we're not done yet because we have another group here. We can collect that and make another 100. Oh, that arrow is kind of annoying. So yeah, here we have 200, which means 20 tens equals 200 because here that's what we showed our work. And see, we have five hundreds. So five hundreds times 10, five times 10 is 50. So five hundreds times 10 is 50 hundreds. And let's label our place value chart. We have the ones, and then we have the tens. All right, so let's see, we have 50 hundreds. So let's draw 50 hundreds. So here's the hundreds. We have seven, eight, nine, ten, and one more. All right, so here we have 50 hundreds. So if we, if a group of 10 tens equals 100, 
a group of 10 ones equals a 10, then a group of 10 hundreds equals a thousand. So let's group it together. So this is 10 hundreds, so this together can make a thousand. And then next group, this can also make another thousand. And then this one oh, can make a thousand. And then this row, oh, that row can make a thousand. And this row can also make a thousand. So now we have one, two, three, four, five. So that's five thousand, which means fifty hundreds equals five thousands. And here's our one. All right, next page. Number two. Complete the following statements using your knowledge of place value. All right, so let's take a look at A. 10 times as many, so 10 times as many as 100, 100 is blank hundreds. So 10 times means times 10. So that means 10 times 100 would be 10 hundreds or 1,000 because all right, we know a group of ten hundreds makes a thousand, so that's over here. Ten thousands equals a thousand. Ten hundreds equals a thousand. And B, ten times as many as blank hundreds is sixty. So let's see, it doesn't give us how many hundreds first, but it ends up with sixty. So we have sixty and ten. Sixty divided by ten is six, which means ten times as many as six hundreds is sixty hundreds or six thousands because we have ten groups of ten hundreds six groups of ten hundreds and now c let's write ten times as many so times ten as eight hundreds eight thousand and then d we have blank hundreds is the same as four thousands well we know a group of hundreds equals a thousand so if there's four thousands then there is probably 40 40 hundreds now it says use pictures numbers or words to explain how you got your answer for part d all right so let's see part d let's just draw our place value chart so our one two three four five we have our tens and we have our hundred. And then we have our thousands. So we have 40 hundreds, so that's over here. So yeah. So we have 40 hundreds here. So let's see, if we take a group of 10 hundreds, that makes a thousand. Another group could also make another thousand. And this group can make a thousand. And this group could also make a thousand. So now we have four thousands, which means that 40 hundreds is the same as four thousands. So that is how that can back up our answer on part D. Number three, Katrina has 60 GB of storage on her tablet. Katrina's father has 10 times as much storage on his computer. How much storage does Katrina's father have? So use words or use numbers or words to explain how you got your answer. So let's use numbers. So she has 60. So 60 is the same as six tens. All right, and her father has 10 times as much. So times 10, six tens times 10 is 60 tens. And 60 tens is the same as 600. So that means Katrina's father has 600. So Katrina's father. 600 GB of storage on his computer. So yeah. 
Alright, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this video helps. And please don't forget to like and subscribe because it really helps on my channel. See you next time. Bye!